Hey Aztec fans, Hunter Hewitt here with GoAztecs.com and we're here today with senior cornerback Josh Wade. Josh, thanks for joining us today. Thanks for having me. Now, you're a local product. You grew up in San Diego. What was your childhood like growing up here? A uh, very good childhood. I mean, uh, I grew up with two older brothers, like nine, eight and nine years older than me. Uh, I had the, the privilege of growing up uh, being a neighbor to my grandfather. He lived right next door to me. I had an aunt that lived two houses down, so I had a lot of family around me, and it was just it was good times. I mean, had a lot of games growing up, older brothers to mess around with, so it was a good, great childhood. You went to Point Loma High School, and not only were you an all-CIF selection at cornerback, but you also played running back, and you rushed for over 1,000 yards your senior year. Did you have hopes of playing running back, or did you always know that cornerback was a position that you wanted to play? Well, it was fun playing, playing running back in high school. I, I looked at the recruiting a little bit, and I figured I had the best chance of playing at corner, and I, I learned to love it more as I got to college. I mean, it was always fun scoring touchdowns in high school, but... The corner, I knew corner was best for me, and I would be most successful at being able to play a little corner in college. So what was your recruiting process like? Was it an easy decision for you to stay close to home and choose SDSU? A uh, very easy decision. I mean, uh, I was offered a scholarship my junior year, and then uh, and going into my senior year, I committed uh, to San Diego State, and I knew I wanted to be a part of this program. I knew it was a great city, and I would have a lot of opportunities to do what I needed to do here and stay close to home. You redshirted in 2008, and then you were able to get a good amount of playing time in 2009 and 2010. What were those two seasons like for you? Uh, very good. I was just uh, getting, getting used to the program, still young. Like, I was on uh, every kickoff. I like to play a little bit of corner, and I just had a great time. That was a good experience. Now, following those two seasons, you're getting ready for a big 2011 season. You were projected at one of the starting cornerback spots. Then in training camp, you suffered a serious Achilles injury that forced you to sit out the entire 2011 season. How tough was that injury for you to overcome both mentally and physically? Uh, it was very tough, uh, mostly mentally. I mean, having to go out every week and watch your brothers fight and, and you couldn't, you not being able to play, it was really tough. I mean, there was nothing more I wanted to do than be able to go and, and play, especially you can see in the bowl game, like that whole week not being able to participate. And uh, it, was just, it was just a learning process and it matured me as a, as a player and as a person going through something like that. After months of rehab, you were able to finally make it back onto the field and you're healthy once again. How redeeming is that feeling for you, knowing that you could battle back from a serious injury and get back into playing form? Oh man, it felt great. I mean, even after I got cleared to just jog and run around again, it was like, like being a kid again, finally getting to play a game. Uh, it was a great, great experience and I'm just excited to be able to uh, be a part of this program again and be able to go out and fight with my brothers every week. You're majoring in kinesiology. When are you expected to graduate, and what type of career aspirations do you have in that field? Uh, I'll be done with school at the end of December. I'll be graduating in the uh, fall. And uh, after that, I think I'm just going to get my uh, personal training uh, certification, and I'm going to go into that field and try to be a personal trainer for a while, get some strength and conditioning uh, experience behind me, and hopefully I can stay uh, working with athletes and being a part of this world that's done so much for me and that I love so much. Okay, Josh, well, thanks for joining us, and best of luck to you the rest of your senior season. Thank you. Aztec fans, stay tuned next week for another version of Aztec Player Profiles.